Hello, welcome back. Have you seen the F1 error code before on your Dexter washer? That means it's a door lock issue. So it's one of a couple three things. Either the door lock solenoid, which sits behind here, is bad, or this just needs adjusting. Or, well, there we go. That's supposed to click. That pin pushes that, so it tells the machine the door is shut. See? Click. And this thing looks jammed in there. So we've got to take the front of the machine, uh, take the front of the machine off, and then probably this ring. Then we can get to that button. So take your lid off. One, one-handed. And that's your, remember your door lock solenoid? Right behind there. That's that. But this one appears to be fine so far. And that's an easy switch out too. And there's a couple bolts here that need to come out that keep the front of the machine on. Right there. That one, and there's one under there. Then there's two screws on the front of the washer. Then four bolts. And you see this box? That's holding that switch. So we have to take that box off. Now I forgot to turn the power off. Uh, maybe we'll be okay. That looks bent up. Kind of weird. Let's see if it's a little better now. Perfect. That should be all. Difficult stuff, huh? If you want to make it easier on yourself, you can just un. Pull these two wires out of the plugs and you can work on the table with it. Then just do everything in reverse. Make sure you don't pinch these wires when you're screwing them in there.
Oh, we gotta reset the power. So, we're good to go here. And this is one of those easy repairs you can do yourself if you don't want to pay $12,000 for a service call. Or if you need the machine up and running for the weekend. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.